So my husband and I, we purchased Moose a la Mode on January 6, 2020. First time in the world, purchased a cafe. And we put everything we had, we sunk every dime that we had into it because this was what we needed. We needed a brick and mortar. We had been doing food trucks for years. It was time to get someplace warm in the winter. Everything was good until March. That's when COVID hit. That day we laid off all the staff. I became a barista at almost 50 years old. I, had, I don't drink coffee. I had never made coffee. So it was my husband and I for 14 hours a day, every day, just waiting for a customer to come by. And back then at that time, you know, the streets were empty. The offices were empty. And there were some days that we didn't know if we would make enough money to even put enough gas in the vehicle to get home. And then the hunger relief program came in and that was the lifeline that we needed. After that first initial contract that we got, we were able to bring back one of our employees. After the second one, we were bring, able to bring back everyone. And it was that program alone that helped us survive. Without that, we would have had to close the doors by May. And so we're just so thankful to the United Way, to the municipality. Because of COVID and because of the relief that we were able to receive, we found that we were strong, determined, able, that we could take you know, these ingredients and make so much with them and not only make you know, the recipients of the hunger relief program happy, but our customers happy. And it gave our customers something to look forward to, some reason to come in, what is the new next thing? And, you know, the money that we had, that we were able to get in, it paid for our employees. It helped. You know, I mean, there were days that we didn't know what we were going to do. It saved us. And now we're still going strong. We have our original employees. We're fully staffed. And, I mean, there, there was a light at the end of the tunnel. And some days I didn't think there would be.